Hello, Gemini. Welcome to your weekly general reading. Wow, two cups like, two cups, <laughs> two cards like that, Jim. Oh boy. So we have the seven of cups. That's confusion. And the king of cups. So I feel like <laughs> I have two thoughts here. Well, more than two, but being a Gemini, how can I not have more than two thoughts, right? So Seven of Cups is having multiple options and going through over and over and over again. And I feel like this week, you're going to be looking at like a million different things and saying, I could do this, I could do that. You know, I envy people who are good at one thing, so good that they don't really, they don't even bother with anything else. But when you're okay at a multitude of things, or, you know, what is it, um, jack of all trades, master of none. I think that we, we risk that at times. And I think what this is saying is with the king of cups, it's follow what makes you happy. The king of cups. And I'm going to read, I don't, I haven't been reading for everybody, but there are some times when I just feel like it's appropriate. And I think this one, it is because... You'll see how I'm attaching this. There's the King of Cups page. Like Neptune, the King of Cups, and I believe Neptune and Pluto, are they both rulers of Scorpio, I think? The King of Cups reigns over the sea. His authority calms turbulent waters. He is creative, compassionate, and often a doctor or counselor. So this is the person, I, there's two thoughts. I think that you should follow your heart, which is why there's all cups. This is all cups. And you should or could be dealing with a water sign. And I did say Scorpio, so I'm going to say possibly a Scorpio who is going to help you figure out what direction, which cup to go with. Wow, that feels so right. Okay, so because of that, I'm going to get you an Angels of Abundance card. Okay, Angels of Abundance for us Gemini. Oh boy. What do we get here? Okay, well, I don't really want to take cards that hit the floor. Let's see if it comes out. I saw what it said. Let's see. But it didn't feel right. So card for Gemini. Angels of Abundance. What can you tell us? Oh, that's too many cards. Well, I have to, no, that's not the same card. I thought it was. Okay, card for Gemini, five. I'm taking the top, unless you give me one. <laughs> Thank you. Raise or, or promotion. Nice. Congratulations, an increase in your abundance flow awaits you. This is a result of your positive focus and willingness to take action based on your divine guidance. Keep up the good work. I think that whatever you've been working on, the divine guidance comes from the King of Cups. That's how you get the raise or promotion. It may not be a literal raise or a literal promotion, but to me, it means that you are on the path that will give you the raise or the promotion that's going to increase your abundance. Keep in mind, to me, abundance can be money, but it can also be a wealth, prosperity in multiple areas, including emotional especially with the cups here. So thank you, Gemini. Looks great. Good luck. And I guess this week, keep an open mind, okay? And don't be afraid to, to take advice. And it may be the right advice, you know? Do your due diligence, but good luck. Thanks, Gemini. Don't forget, thumbs up, subscribe. Have a great week. Bye.